what is up guys real 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 quick make sure you shop with me my website is going to be linked in the description below make sure you go follow my instagram the naima marie shop where you will be updated every time i drop new products sales all of that stuff y'all shop with me support your girl black owned business i have everything um i have these name necklaces i have lip gloss i have shampoo conditioner leave-in conditioner styling glaze edge control um twist out cream it's more like a thick thick consistency though but yes make sure you shop with me and let's get into this video, y'all. Always. What's up, Melly Mafia? It's your girl, not Melly, not Melly. That like my girl, everybody be watching. Uh-huh, and yeah, sure, I got the frontal action going on. And remember, this is the same wig. I cut it a little bit shorter. And this hair is from Xavier Kyrie on Facebook, and I will have her link down below. Ooh. But yes, y'all, where have you been, not Melly? Where have you been? So y'all, we gonna get right into that. We gonna get into this video right now. All right, y'all. So yes, I'm back. I'm better than ever. Um, I took a little break. I'm trying to find myself. Just trying to find myself. I didn't need a break from social media. I needed a break from myself, my brain, my thoughts. Um, with the rebrand. With the rebrand. Why my juice is all the way across? I'm about to just get another juice. Oh, you know what? Un momento. I'm gonna be great and drink water. No juice. Um, yes, I've been trying to find myself. Um, depression is real, guys. Like, depression is real. Like, you may think somebody has it all figured together. You may think they're successful from just looking at, um, social media and it's just real it's real depression is real um you may feel like you're alone like sometimes i really be feeling like i'm alone and have a whole husband i have people that care about me i have people that want me to succeed in life and sometimes like they said that saying you you in a room full of people and you still feel like you're alone there's a lot of demons that I have inside of me that I've been working on with myself, battling, that I would share with you guys because I'm trying to be transparent. I can't be as transparent with you guys because I'm a YouTuber. My husband isn't a YouTuber. And I can only be so transparent with you guys to certain extents without, you know, sharing his business because he didn't sign up for this. I signed up for this. So I can only be as transparent with you guys and tell y'all like a few things but not so much because judgment, um, social media is just is very very judgmental and they take small things and run with it and I don't want that, I don't want that for my family, I don't want that for them. So it's like, oh, what so much I will share with you guys, just protecting, to protect him and to protect others, you know? I'm not single, so I gotta do that. I gotta protect my family at the end of the day. And I don't do this for views. I do this for fun because I love doing this for you guys. Um, But yeah, like, I had to just find myself. Y'all, I hate when I be watching YouTubers and they be going like this. Like, I know you still... Sis, I know you still thirsty. I'm learning to talk into the camera instead of at my lens right there. <laughs> but y'all, y'all can't tell me this wig ain't bomb. And I've been practicing. I've been really practicing because I want to start wearing my wigs. Um, what did I use? 
I just used the got to be glue method. I don't have the cap underneath this because let me tell y'all what happened. Let me tell y'all what happened. <sighs> Last night, right? I went to bed and I had a side part. Then my um cat, then my got to be glue, everything was lit. You know, I got the alcohol to clean up the crusty crusties that the got to be glue be leaving. I woke up. My head scarf wasn't on anymore. My wig was lifting up all in the front. Also on top of when I had like took it off to reapply it and to just clean the perimeter. That little cat method, it was like all the way back here. Like the cat was supposed to be, I glued it right here and the cat was like all the way back here. So I was like, you know what? I'm not going to do the cat method until I like actually know what I'm doing. Now let's get a close up. Let's get a close up. I don't know. For me, I feel like it's a little, the lace is a little, uh, I don't know what I did because the lace ain't wasn't this dark. I don't know what the freak I did. Maybe it's my makeup. I don't know what I did, y'all. But the lace was not that dark. But I think these are her raw bundles. And it's... And y'all know I washed it. All right. So last video I said I didn't wash the wig. I washed the wig this video. And I washed it with the Melly Mafia shampoo and conditioner. And it's stiff wear. Huh? Huh? Yes, like, sis. I'm giving Olivia Benson vibes over here. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm dead. I need help. I really need freaking help. But yes, I just wanted to come back and sit down and talk to you guys. Oh, I don't have nothing planned for the day. I don't have anything planned for the day. I'm just sitting behind my desk taking orders i just ran to the post office right quick because i was kind of late shipping out of order sorry girl um yeah i was kind of late shipping out of order so i had to hurry up and run to the post office and whatever and i did not all right so everybody's asking about these tie-dye t-shirts i didn't get them started well i tie-dyed them of course but i didn't get the words um printed out on them just 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 yet and y'all know I print my words up. Mm. I print my own words and I do my own thing and whatever. But yes, y'all, I'm back. I'm back. I'm gonna be creating content for you guys, trying to do it every day. Like, I need to go back to the old me. I was looking at my old videos and y'all, like, I was doing numbers. I was kind of doing numbers to be a small YouTuber versus now. Like, now I begin like nine views. Like, I don't know, I was doing numbers. Like, I just needed to get out of the depression that I was in. Like, literally just cry, 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 cry because I just felt help I felt helpless. I was feeling sorry for myself. You cannot feel sorry for yourself. You just have to keep pushing. You have to keep moving. You have to find that motivation. And like my husband, me and my husband was talking last night and he said a lot of things that I didn't want to hear, but I needed to hear. Didn't want to hear it. He told me, basically... I just need to y'all sorry like my Facebook is blowing up right now I don't know he just told me what I needed to hear not what I wanted to hear like I just felt like giving up I felt like giving up on everything not only my business not only YouTube like y'all know I just spit so bread on the camera to give y'all this bomb quality and I'm sorry but my quality kind of better than these big youtubers mm. but oh, let me turn on my light the natural light is hitting but it ain't hitting hit. Ooh, ooh, sis, sis. Come on. All right, back to what I was saying. But yeah, like, I just needed to. I. He needed to have that conversation with me, if that makes sense. He needed to have that conversation with me. I needed to sleep on it. I needed to wake up and I needed to get back to doing what I set out to freaking do. Take over the internet. Take over the industry. Take over the game. Like. I needed to get back to me. I needed to get back to doing what I love. Don't, and not worry about anything else. I just been going through it. <laughs> like going through it. Like right now, you guys know, I quit my job. I quit Target. Um, I do have a part-time job, which I work one day a week, which isn't doing anything for my existence, anything for my life. Um, some money is better than no money. 
the state that I live in right now have no jobs like no jobs are harming not even fast food because you know your girl don't care I gotta do what I gotta do to take care of me to take care of my family my husband has to do what he has to do to take care of me take care of him take care of our family uh, and when I say take care of my family meaning me and my husband because everybody in my family is taken care of so just mean him um he needs to be able to provide i need to be able to provide this is a team effort and i feel like i just feel like it wasn't going that way like it just was not going that way i can't rush the process like my business will take off i get orders don't get me wrong i get orders it's not enough to live off of that was just like me working one day a week it's not enough to live off of um it's enough to sustain and maintain but it's not enough to really like be out here in the world on my own and whatnot but yeah like i feel like i can't let it defeat me i can't let some of the trials and tribulations that i have been going through defeat me at all like if i let it defeat me then the devil wins and i don't want the devil to win like i just have to keep going i have to keep doing what i need to do i need to keep pushing on and yeah y'all i just gotta keep creating dope content for my babies the melly mafia gang gang like <laughs> i gotta keep creating content for y'all i'm feeling this week i was gonna straighten it out because literally this hair is so bomb when i cut it it just automatically just flip up like that because it's a healthy wig like I think it's this is her raw Indian. I want to say this is like raw Indian because this ain't a Brazilian baby. Brazilian hair don't do this. Brazilian hair ain't this silky. Like that, baby. This ain't no Brazilian. You are so Brazilian. Uh, uh. <laughs> but yeah, I'm glad to be back and better, baby. Back and better. But all right y'all so that's the end of this video make sure you like comment and subscribe make sure you hit that notification bell make sure you give this video a thumbs up team Melly mafia all day every day if you didn't know now you know on the road to 1k big things popping little things stopping and we out Melly mafia gang gang oh and we back like a crack on the back and again like <laughs>